to taxonomy online mathematics we are still on the topic calculus and we are taking differentiation this time around on sums and differences so if i have a differentiation whereby the functions are adding all that i'm expected to do is to find the differentiation of the function of f of x add it on to the differentiation of the function of g of x then i subtract the differentiation of the age of x so if for example i am asked to differentiate let's say 6 x to the power 3 plus 4 x squared plus x minus 7 with respect to x what it means is that my dy dx is just going to be I differentiate this value add it to the differential of this the differential of this and subtract that from it so let's go under this the exponent multiply the constant because we are holding the constant and that will give us 6 times 3 x exponent 3 then we reduce the value of the exponent by 1 plus we hold the constant we bring the exponent to multiply the whole function then we reduce the value of the exponent here it is going to be all this coming together that is there is a one there the one will come in front to multiply when you subtract one from one give you what zero so one exponent zero will give us just what one minus if i differentiate a constant i get what zero from our previous videos so here this is just going to be 18 x exponent 2 plus 8 x exponent 1 plus what one so if you are performing differentiation and there is addition you just perform the differentiation on each of the term and add them together or subtract them together so this is what you get if you are asked to differentiate let's take another example so we are asked to differentiate this function with respect to x we know this is three adding onto this adding onto this they are all different different terms so we differentiate this we differentiate we differentiate but this is multiplying another factor so the function is going to be if i use this to multiply it give me 3 on x plus 4 on 4x on x then plus 5x squared on what x so watching from this side you can see that there's a common factor here common factor Okay, so y is just going to be, we can rewrite this as holding 3, multiplying 1 on x. If I want to write this, the 3 will multiply, 1 divided by x will give me this value. And 1 over x can also be written as exponent of what? Minus 1. So the whole of this is just going to be 3x exponent minus 1 plus this will cancel this will have 4 plus this will cancel since this is x times x this x will cancel one of them so we are just left with 5x so if i'm to differentiate that function i am going to have this i am holding the constant multiplying the exponent that multiply the function then we reduce the exponent by one plus if we differentiate a constant you get zero plus if we differentiate this the whole of this is going to be one so we have only what five so in all i'll be having minus three x exponent minus two plus five i can present my answer in this form or i can try to get a positive value as my exponent so i can still say that minus three as in this is multiplying the reciprocal of this is going to be all over x exponent 2 then we add 
our five to it. So we can leave our answer in this form, or we can also leave it in this form. All right. So that is how we perform differentiation on sum and differences. If you like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Tazunomi Online Mathematics. Thank you, and God bless you.